Hi, my name is Fredrik Berglund and I'm working at the Astonishing Tribe in Malmö, Sweden. And today I would like to show you how to create a cover flow list on an uh, HTC Hero Android phone using uh, TAT Motion Lab and TAT Cascades. So this is TAT Motion Lab, our UI editor where we can define the look and feel of our XML based UI. I'm starting off with creating a list node and a data service node and the data source today is just an ordinary list with pictures of animals and some text labels. I will start defining the general look and feel for the list, in this case a three-dimensional viewport with some transforms and then the look and feel for each of the list elements, in this case an ordinary three-dimensional plane. I can at any time just launch the built-in cascades simulator to just check out how my current UI looking feels like. And this is actually a real Windows port of cascades and not a slow, boring emulator. I'm putting in some more animations in order to make the list transitions feel smooth and alive and also changing the unique positions and rotations for each of the list elements. I'm tweaking the animations slightly and putting also inner reflection in the bottom of each of the list elements. Cascades also has a graphical design view which makes it easy to lay out components such as texts and images without having to know the exact x and y position. Cascades make it easy for us to put a text label that is linked to the current focused item. This is a feature that Cascades provide us. I'm also putting in some animations, some camera movements, so when we start the application the UI zooms in on the list. Cascades makes it easy for us to define focus in and focus out animations and I'm finishing off this list by putting in a little bounce when an item gets focused. In the same way we can test out our UI directly on the PC inside Motion Lab, we could just easily deploy it on any Android device as well. So let's see, I'm currently uploading the uh, Cascades demo onto the uh, device and it here it starts. We have this 3D list and we can just test out the concept quickly and we can also see if performance is as we expect it to be. So this is actually how easy it is to, to work with TAT Motion Lab and TAT Cascades, making it very very convenient to prototype and actually sketch directly on the device.